Increased antibody testing will be critical in not only determining just how widespread the coronavirus is, it could also help determine how soon the American workforce can be fully redeployed. CBS Force Kerry Cott is in Fort Lauderdale with more on local testing efforts. Broward County residents continue to access walk-up testing sites in the county on Thursday, and now the National Guard is preparing to open a walk-up testing site in Miami-Dade on Friday. It will be at the Holy Family Catholic Church in North Miami. Testing is on everyone's mind as the country itches to return to work and figure out how widespread the COVID-19 virus is and who might have already been affected and managed to fight it off. All eyes were on New York Friday as Governor Andrew Cuomo said antibody testing there showed that as much as 13.9% of the population may have had COVID-19. These are people who were infected and who developed the antibodies to fight the infection. Experts suggest that may mean the virus is not as deadly as once thought since more people appear to have overcome it. Doctors at the University of Miami are conducting antibody testing. The results of those tests are not known thus far. Dr. Luis Caldera Nieves has worked for Jackson Health System. He died of COVID-19. His wife and several of his children tested positive for the coronavirus, and they've recovered. They want others like them to get tested so they can donate plasma to help critically ill patients. Everybody has it and donate, but they need a place to, for the second test. Open a place to test people that already are positive, that already are without symptoms in two weeks. And they may be getting their wish. Miami-Dade says they've started retesting for positive COVID-19 patients at several sites, including at Marlins Park and the Youth Fair. Experts say the plasma is already working for some patients. The use of convalescent plasma is rooted in the fact that people who are infected build antibodies to that infection. And then once they recover, those antibodies that they develop can then be transfused into other people that are critically ill in an effort to boost up their immune system to fight off that infection. That plasma donation is being done at One Blood here in Broward. To donate, we're told you need a lab confirmed positive test for COVID 19 and to be symptom free for 14 days before you can donate. As for the testing here at this walk up site in Fort Lauderdale along Northwest 27th Avenue, they concluded around 6 o'clock for the day and will reopen tomorrow. In Fort Lauderdale, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News.